I came to Gothenburg because I really wanted to live in a sustainable city. I am passionate about sustainability um, and in South Africa sustainability is still quite a new field. It's amazing how, how people who don't know each other can already make such strong links in such a small amount of time. I think it's just the perfect city to be in during the summer. Um, it's not very big, it's very cozy, it's still cosmopolitan, it's still multicultural. There's still a lot, so much things to do during the night and during the day. I really liked Gothenburg as a location. I had no idea about the archipelago, so that was a fun a surprise also, being able to go um, to the islands, go for a swim, and there's such easy access to nature here. You just hop on a tram for like 20 minutes and you're in the woods. It's been great to be with so many different students from so many different countries. I definitely wasn't um, like expecting that to be the case. I knew it was an international school, but I thought it would still be uh, a lot of people from Sweden. It was amazing um, to listen to people from Germany, Italy, Singapore, Indonesia. I would never in my life be able to meet people from so many different places in the world, like literally all five continents, pretty much. Um, so yeah, it's a very nice experience. I think it really opens up your perspectives and horizons on the world. Sustainability is a wholesome topic, you know. You need, need to attack it from all, every angle. So getting different perspectives of different people, different countries, and sort of working out a solution or mm, some perspective to have in, in my own country and maybe uh, to change my own perspective. The programs are very well thought, even though it's only five weeks. Um, it feels like every day we're just learning new things. The small excursions we do, the talks we have with uh, uh, guest lectures. I would definitely highlight the workshop we had on the SDG assessment tool. It was not something I was familiar with or probably even heard of. Uh, so to be able to, in a group with different people, to just sit down and use it was very thoughtful. Sometimes for one SDG to be fully implemented or activated, some others might be a little more trickier to, to combine. I would say that the level of uh, complexity that uh, we engage with, on, with the sustainability issues, it's definitely something I would highlight. I learned that most of what we, I've been taught in my previous classes have been from a very anthropocentric point of view and it's totally shifted my perspective and how I've been learning and definitely how I will view teaching sustainability in the future and being taught sustainability. The biggest thing I learned about sustainability issues is that people still, there are a lot of people who do care about it and if we work together then we can actually make a pretty big difference. Um, we just have to get going right now. We can't waste any time.